Hello everyone, welcome to Combat Training Road to Commander Episode 2. So, where we last left off, we were kicking some ass in Nuketown, and we're going to do that again, except we're going to have one computer partner. And basically, I'm going to work my, up, my way up to six computer partners, once, and a couple of matches after the starting of six, I'm going to go right back down to one. And it's gonna, just going to keep going that way. Basically, these are, this is my setup. Scavenger, I have Scavenger, Steady Aim, and Marathon. Scavenger, so I don't run out of ammo, um, because I am using Steady Mag. Steady Aim, because that's just the best thing for spraying in Marathon, so I can get up close and personal. That's the entire point of having Steady Aim for spraying. Is, uh, being up close and personal is really fucking badass with Steady Aim. You, like, rip through your fucking shit. As you can probably see right there. And this extended mag is along me so far because this is a lot of common area. I haven't even seen anything. Like, I don't know what's going to happen in this match, but so far I think this is actually one of the best class setups I've had for a while. Um, yeah, MP5K rapes when using extended mags and uh, steady aim. It does okay without steady aim or extended mags, but still, together they fucking destroy everything. And then with scavenger added on top of that, I'm not gonna run out of ammo anytime soon, so I can keep up a kill streak for a while. I didn't realize it, it picked up my uh, care package for a moment there, and I was pulling that out thinking it was a spy plane, thinking, oh shit, why the fuck is my spy plane working? <laughs> Anyways, I like what uh, Ferret did with some of the launchers in this. They even made some, like, fucking kill streak launchers, which is a lot better than uh, the ones that they give you at the start. Ow. There's my other account getting this ass right by me. But there. And I go down, so... Oh, sweet, I spawned right next to where my care package is supposed to land, so... Eh, ammo. Not, not the best. Since I want to get my challenges early so I can have a lot more help leveling up in this thing, I'm going to be using grenades quite a bit for the scavenger-wise classes. You know, classes that I have scavenger on because... One of the needs for... Um, that is one of the needs for, uh, the thing. But, um, that's one of the needs for Scavenger Pro. And I enjoy having Scavenger Pro, so I don't, but I also spawn with more mags, even. So I don't even need to go pick some up before I can have a whole shitload of them. That'd really help with a fucking extended mag, uh, character, too. So again, this is all recorded live. Um, if my mic does stop working though, or my camera stops working, I may go a couple of matches off camera. I'm sorry about that, but you know, it's, it could happen at any time because this is, even though this is a brand new computer, you never fucking know. Now I'm hoping it doesn't fuck up because I really want to be fair with it. I don't want you guys to think that I'm cheating or anything. I'm already got uh, ready for deployment within two matches. Sweet. Oh, 
Um, whoa. I just got a whole shitload of fucking <laughs> challenges. That's kind of odd, but whatever. Fucking epic. Probably because I uh, I had done everything in those challenges, needing those challenges, but those were the few that just unlocked when I reached level 10. So that gave all of them to me at that particular time, once I actually could unlock them. And there was a, that was a challenge spree. So now, I've already got one thing for Scavenger Pro, and I'm aiming on getting the next one soon, maybe by the end of this match or next match. I want to call him this uh, tech out of it. Also, next match, we will have some different kill streaks running now. Um, they probably won't be too high because I am i don't expect myself to be going very high uh, this early on in my character thing. So, yeah. So, level 12 already. Got to about level 8 net last time, so I'm wondering what we're going to be uh, at by the end of this one, maybe level 15. Anyway. Care package ready for direction. Show us where you want it. Friendly care package about. Friendly spy plane about. Friendly care package all the way. Enemy spy plane above. I'm going to wait until both these come in. I'm going to pick them up first. Order team standing them. by. You know. RPXT ready for deployment. I want to try to get the finishing moves already. So I'm going to try to get maybe my final kill cam with the death machine, because the death machine seems to be one of the rarer items you can get off of a care package. Done. Anyway, that was my brother showing up, just saying, you know. Anyways, we are going to, uh, I don't right over there, pull out my pistol, pull out my MP5 gate, get a grenade kill, so there we are, one, one step closer to our scavenger pro. And, oh, 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 triple. We're even closer. We're about three steps closer to our uh, governor pro. Oh, shit, we were so close to that guy, man. Bot these bots can be a real pain in the fucking ass. Cobra so it sometimes will just be a dick. And they'll be wearing five jacks the fucking second that you throw a grenade. By that I mean, like, you'll throw a grenade and it turns out that we'll be wearing black jackets, so or they'll throw them back. Right, I do. So there's a, yep, so we got that already. I think that's a nice black grenade kill. Friendly care package you about. Friendly care package all the way. 
Or not. I mean, maybe I'll just get a triple kill with it. Works for me either way. Works for my bike. Alright, so we're going to let our bot friend get one kill while having our little... Yes. Mission accomplished. Good work. So, anyways, I will see you guys next time on. Call of Duty Black Ops Combat Training Road to Commander. Goodbye.